The Indiana Department of Education released its latest proposal for high school diploma, diploma requirements two months ago, but many Hoosiers remain concerned about it. News 10's Rachel Law is in our studio with more. Rondrell, the latest draft of the Indiana High School Diploma would give high schoolers one diploma option, but with that one option, there would be three paths student could take, enrollment, employment, and enlistment, but many Hoosiers still have questions. It's a good start. However, there still needs a lot more work to be done. Indiana State Representative Tanya Paff says the latest Indiana High School Diploma proposal has missing details. The three paths, enrollment, enlistment, and employment, would give students real-world experience. Her concerns are mainly about guaranteeing students' safety as well as transportation to go off campus. She not only brings up questions about the students, but staff having to adhere to these changes, too. I'm not sure how these counselors are going to figure out every single kid, what's their diploma track, where are they going to go for a work-based opportunity, can they get there, do they have the requirements, it's just a lot. And again, the state of Indiana is asking counselors to do more with less resources. She's also concerned about finding enough placements for students on the different paths. I have a real problem with where are we going to find all these internships, because right now we're already struggling with the program we have. PATH hopes the Department of Education will reconsider the proposal. Despite some concerns, many Indiana universities are in support of the latest draft. Indiana University, Indiana State University, and Purdue University are among that group to say the new proposal meets their requirements. Shout to those universities with PATH specific concerns. So far, we haven't heard back. To view the latest high school diploma proposal, you can check out our website at WTHITV.com. Back to you.